Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Tom Clancy's The Division. We are going to be running over here and checking out what the unknown signal is. I have no idea what it is. Um, I don't know if it's going to be something short, uh, like this video will be less than 10 minutes or something like that, or if this is going to be a longer video uh, with something actually happening. I, I, I have no idea. And so we're going to go ahead and go check it out. I should, I believe tomorrow I'll do um, some bulk recording on this game uh, in which we just run around and do encounters and stuff like that, trying to finish off the base and finish off all of that different stuff. I'll just do some free roaming episodes, uh, and hopefully it doesn't take too long. Um, I would like to be, to get, to not get done with this game, but get have all the stuff that I need to do for videos done, I guess is what I'm trying to say. But we will see. Just gonna, you know, talk on our little run over here. I, I think I could have fast traveled a little bit closer, but I just chose not to. What level are you, idiots? They do scale kind of level wise. This is like a level two area. Um, but I would assume we've only got a few more, maybe two. I'm hoping just two or three more episodes of this before we are done with it. And then it is quantum break time. This game. That's what. That's the real reason I want to get done with this and be done and over with this game is because Quantum Break is coming out next week on Tuesday, uh, and I'd like to trade this game in towards Quantum Break when it releases as well. Like, I'm trading in this and Far Cry Primal as well as Madden 16 uh, just towards Primal and then whatever's left, or not Primal, towards uh, Quantum Break, and then whatever's left over I'm just going to put on my Dark Souls 3 pre-order. I still haven't decided if I'm going to buy the Estus Flask Edition for Dark Souls 3 uh, for the strategy guide. I still haven't quite decided. If they have it at my GameStop, I'll definitely buy it because it'll just be sitting there mocking me and I'll just be like, okay, take my money. If I have to get it online, my restraint may be better. Oh, wait. Hold on. How do I... Wait, how do you do this mission? It says the entrance is, like, right here at the corner. That's clearly not the case. Um... Ready to knock some heads. Wait, what? I don't get it. Am I supposed to be... Is there something here? I don't get it. I don't get it, dude. What is this? Am I supposed to... I, I don't get this at all. Unknown signal, right? Here, it doesn't make any sense. It can't have something to do with going to the hub, can it? No, because that's way over here. That leaves the mission area. It's almost like it wants you to go up top. It's like it wants you to go up here. It actually looks like it's inside the building. So how do I get inside the building? Let's see if I can figure this out. I know there's something in here. What was that? What do you honestly think you'll achieve with it? The lockdown is a necessary precaution to control the situation. We have enough to handle as it is. But what are you doing to let people pass through? Most people just want to leave the city to meet with their family. We will reevaluate the relocation plan at some point, but for now, the lockdown holds. Now, miss, 
I've got work to do here. You really should stop looking for trouble and make sure your own family is safe. Well, I am thoroughly confused. I don't get this at all. The, the sign is inside of that for the start of the mission, but I can't get inside. There's no way to get inside. So I don't have any idea what to do here. I've got literally no idea. And I hate when this happens with games like... Really? Like, why do you gotta be... Why do you gotta be so secretive? Fine! I'm doing it in the video. We're going to YouTube. We're figuring out what the heck the unknown signal is. Because I have no idea, so... Let's go ahead and um, collect seeds. I wonder how loud this is by typing. Um, plant seeds, the division. Unknown signal. Okay, how do you get inside? Yeah, of course there's going to be an ad. I bet it's a non-skippable ad, so I have to sit here and... Oh, no, it's a skippable ad. Thank you, Xbox. How ironic. It's an advertisement for Quantum Break. I was just talking about that. Wait, what the hell? In this dude's playthrough, the door is open. Is this mission not completed correctly? No, it's completed. Well, I don't get it. This thing is open in that dude's. This thing is open in his. I don't get it. How do you get that thing open? This is going to be a video of me stumbling around trying to figure this out because... Okay, let's go with this dude's video. This dude's video is a little bit longer. Come on! I can figure this out. Why is this not opening? Yeah, open seven days a week, my ass. I gotta be missing something. What the hell did I do wrong? I don't get it. I'm really confused. Why is this thing closed? Am I missing something easy? I'm literally just trying to think, what did I possibly do wrong? I don't get it. Do you have to be like level 30 or something? Thoroughly freaking confused. Hmm. Well. I don't get it. I don't get it because this thing is not down for any of them. Let's try one more thing, I guess. We fast travel here and then run from here and see if that works. But this is so annoying. Why is this not working? Why can't the game just work? Okay. Wait, I hadn't looked at this before. Oh. I've been in here before. How did I not look at that? Okay. Oh, unknown signal. Where the hell is this thing at to this way? Here we go, moment of truth. Do I figure this out or not? Let's 
It all comes down to this. I doubt I'll upload this if I don't find it, so if I don't figure this out, you probably... Or if you're seeing this, I probably figured it out. But this is ten minutes of the struggle. Please, just the... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Nope, it's still closed. I don't get it. I don't get it, dude. This makes no sense. Makes no sense! I don't get it! Fuck you, game. Like, what the hell? You have to... The only thing I can think of is you gotta be level 30. That's the only logical explanation I can have for this. Otherwise, it just doesn't make any sense. It just doesn't make any sense why this wouldn't be open for me. I don't really get what I could have possibly done wrong. Alright, well. Good shit. I, I guess that's the end because this fucking door isn't open for me. Ah, so annoying. So annoying and so disappointing. Alright, I'm gonna try one more thing. And if this doesn't work, this game can suck my dick. Because I don't get it. This is, this is annoying enough that it almost makes me want to just quit playing. Okay, your account is temporarily unavailable. We apologize for you. Okay. I don't really get what that was about. Alright, this is the last... The last chance is for me to... Log in here. And pray that this works. Okay, continue game. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna be heated. I'm probably trading this game in. Because I don't get why the door is closed. It's gotta be, you gotta be level 30, because I have everything completed. If I needed to do something else, it would say in the bottom left, like, talk to Benitez, or talk to... I wonder if my game got all jacked up because I wasn't at the location when, um, that dude was talking to whoever it was. I don't know exactly, Fei Lao, I think is who he was talking to at base. I wasn't there. So I wonder if that totally screwed all of this up. Now it's gonna t I don't get why- why is it taking so long to load me in? Come on, you can do it! Come on! This takes so long to- why is it taking so long to load me in? Hopefully you fixed your shit. Alright! Let's do this one last time. Public health officials have confirmed that a hazardous biological threat has been confirmed in your area. Oh, is, is that what... that's what this is all about. Yeah, okay. Thank you for telling me at the end of the game. Because, you know, I couldn't decipher what the issue was here throughout the whole entire game. Ah, uh, doesn't look like it's open. Oh my god, it is open. What the? What the hell? What the hell, game? Well. Wow. Really? Freaking really? Look at see if there's any loot in here. Alright, that that's just that's enough. Alright, where is this signal thing at?
That's enough, though. Active echo beacon detected. Guess I can be happy I freaking figured it out. Well, here I am, Aaron Keener, the first wave's prodigal son. Normally I'd do this face to face, but I'm not 100% sure which way it'll jump. You act one way when Ms. Lao is watching, and another way entirely when you're off the leash. That's an interesting contradiction. You see, I think that deep down, you get it. You know, the old rules, laws, governments, those things died on Black Friday. But the feral PMCs, the convicts, the ones smart enough and good enough to take what they need, they'll survive. Me? I'm gonna prosper. Oh, you could too, but you took an oath, right? You got a duty. Those are both ways of saying that your conscience is fucking you. You ask yourself, who has earned a right to tell you what to do? Do you know how many agents died to hold the dark zone just for the brass to give up and put a wall around it? You don't believe me? You should check the place out for yourself. But the people you're working for, they're irrelevant now. Amherst changed how the game is played, and I have got the vision to win. I got Chernenko, I got a DNA printer, and a very interesting recipe book. I'm gonna write my own rules. You should think about getting in on this thing. I'll be seeing you. All right, I think that is it. So that was pretty cool. Agent, the information you found in that lab was the crown jewel. I think we can break this thing now. But we've got some more information. A voice from the grave. Listen to what Amherst has to say. What you're looking at is the smallpox virus, one of the deadliest pathogens on the planet. For centuries, it did a wonderful job of helping keep the human population in check. But times change, and sometimes Mother Nature needs a hand in improving her creations. Like, say, speeding them up a little bit, making them contagious when they should be quietly incubating in a host, or making them more lethal. I didn't come up with the approach on my own. My friend Vitaly is one of the pioneers in the field, and the idea has been around for years. Genome as data. You see, once we digitized DNA, we made it infinitely mutable. We could do a thousand virtual variations in the time it used to take to grow a one lab grade generation of pathogens. And we could pick the best, most lethal combinations and make them real. That's how you make a killer virus, you see. Mix in genetic code from other diseases and you move the sliders all the way up on lethality and virulence. The goal was a 90% mortality rate. I'm not sure my green poison is going to quite hit that, but honestly, that's just details. As long as most of humanity goes, the Earth stands a fighting chance. Technically, technology is what's killing the planet. But that's not really the case. It's the greed that drives the technology. But a funny thing happened on the way to $100 genome maps and 3D printed plastic toys. Someone figured out those technologies could be repurposed. Modified for the greater good. Me. Now, my virus is going to do what nature's always done. Decide who lives and who dies. And if nature decides I die, then I die. If nothing else, I'll have a lot of company. Natural selection at its finest helped along by a little unnatural genetic manipulation. It's all data, really. Life's just a method of processing it.
the same way I processed the smallpox genome on my laptop. And who's to say that wasn't the plan all along? If, by some miracle, you survive green poison, then nature's decided you deserve to live. The rest of us shouldn't and won't. Godspeed. I'll see you in hell. Oh, that was pretty cool. Um, do we want to... I think I'm going to go through and... Yeah, do we want to do that? I think we saw all of them. I don't think I missed any. So, I don't think I'm going to replay them. Sorry about the rage at the beginning of this video. It just annoys me when crap like that happens. Like, things that should be there for you aren't. It just really annoys me. And that stupid thing being closed is just annoying. Like, why did your server fuck up? Like, that, that's the only thing that makes no sense to me. Is it because I did it in co-op and then didn't finish it in co-op? Because that's just stupid. Uh, but I guess if that happens to you, just reload your game. I apologize for the rage again. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys probably in some free roaming uh, tomorrow. Uh, we'll see how much free roaming I do. I gotta have all the free roaming done by Tuesday. But... I'll do my best to do that, but I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.